Hello and welcome to the Mastercam Advanced 3D course from eApprentice. This course follows the beginner course and teaches how to use the 3D toolpaths available in Mastercam. In the beginning course, we programmed a number of parts using 2D toolpaths. 2D toolpaths work in just two dimensions. Typically, they go to a specified Z value and then move along the X and Y axes to cut shapes. They are effective toolpaths in a number of situations, but with demand increasing for complex shaped parts, it's impossible to rely on them for all of your machining needs. 3D toolpaths cut complex shapes by moving the cutting tool in the X, Y, and Z axes all at the same time, based on 3D surface or solid geometry. These toolpaths can be used to create extremely precise and complex curves and other shapes. They work first by roughing out the shape and then removing very small amounts of material with each pass, often moving just a few thousandths between passes. After machining, small ridges are left over from between the passes which are easily sanded smooth. These toolpaths are relatively easy to program but can take hours of machine time to run large parts. You'll need to know what your customer is expecting in order to balance machine time with hand finishing time. We'll start off by applying a variety of toolpaths to a relatively simple shape in order to give you an idea of how each one works and give you a better understanding of how 3D toolpaths work. 